Hey everybody, Matumbo here. We are coming at you today with some more magic. We are going to play our take on an Esper deck that I've seen uh, make its way around uh, some streams. Um, the, the, the weird little twist to this deck is it splashes red for our friend Nicol Bolas, the Dragon God. So let's, uh, let's go ahead and take a look at this deck. It is very fun. Um, again, just a Esper control build um, with red for Nicol Bolas. Um, so we're just going to go through it real quick. Uh, so the Vantress Gargoyle, this this card is really just to help build our graveyard if we need to with uh, to feed it for it with Dance of the Mance uh, or to stop the early game aggro because there is a lot of red, um, you know, when you're trying to rank up. Um, same with the birth of uh, Melodis. This is going to let you ramp to get your land. It doesn't really ramp you, but it does guarantee that you're going to be pulling lands for the next turns and the following turns. Othakaya, again, helps against aggro. Um, it's going to gain you some life, going to kill off an attacker, maybe a Planeswalker like a Teferi, a uh, Narset, uh, something along those lines. Uh, Teferi, obviously, one of the best cards in Standard. We're just going to continue to abuse Teferi in any possible way. And uh, Teferi is going to let us do some dumb things like instant speed shatter the sky to, to wrath the board. It's going to let us instant um, dance the manse. Um, it's just, again, Teferi is just busted. Um, the only thing that I might consider in this deck would be to up the count of Dance of the Mance by one, maybe drop Omen of the Sea by one. Um, potentially, I've also thought about putting in uh, maybe one or two more Gargoyles just for the aggro. But again, I haven't really been, f I really don't feel like I've been facing a lot of aggro decks. Um, but yeah, and what really what i really really like about this is people don't really expect nickel bolus um these interplanar beacons are great they're going to gain you life they're going to you know when you're playing off your early game to fairies uh and then all of a sudden our friend nickel bolus here just hits the board and they're just like oh where did this come from you really you rarely ever have to search for the mountain it's it rarely ever comes into play um and then again i think one of the one of the other best cards in standard or the two other best cards in standard uh doom foretold this is a staple it's just any deck that plays black or white needs to be playing doom foretold i feel uh obviously maybe except for some some of the more uh aggro -y decks uh and elspeth conquers death this card is just overlooked a lot this card is really busted um there's so many turns where you obviously you'll exile something of theirs then all of a sudden they'll come back, they'll kill your Planeswalker, and then as soon as they kill your Planeswalker on your next turn, that Planeswalker is right back into play. Um, so again, uh, it's a 24 land deck. I broke up the lands into two piles so you can actually see all of them. Um, this deck is a lot of fun. I, I've had some games that I've recorded, or that did not get to record, that I wish I could have gotten to record. Uh, but we are going to get into the gameplay here. Um, let's, let's load them up, and let's see how we do. All right, let's see what we get here. Kibido. All right. <clears throat> Esper Bolas. Let's do it to it. It's a pretty good hand. Keep... White is obviously the main color in this deck, so we're gonna. I don't ever really want to search out of planes, but we're going. Was this the sack deck or? All right, so we probably want to shatter. Well. I kind of like both of these. Let's, <clears throat> Let's go ahead and just keep permanence off the board. Okay. I 
think we are going to get rid of this Woe Strider. Force him to sack it. He'll sack the goat as well. If he knows what's good for him. Yep, yep. Ooh, keeps it on top. Okay. I mean, so he's kind of incentivized not to play anything right now, but... Okay. I mean, this just gets me to Bolus, right? <laughs> yeah. Let's just do it. I mean, he's 100% he's going to kill this here. Interesting. Okay. Okay. He's got now Compadre. Midnight Reaper. Okay. Okay. Don't feel like... I kind of feel like we want to save that for that. Let's go ahead and do this. Some life. Make him recast this. Sack that cat. I mean, this is a really hard position to come back from. Okay. Here we go. Just go ahead and force some action. There's just a lot of good synergy in this deck, guys. I recommend it. Okay. He is living the dream. Now, oh, Scry 2 is so good. Oh, three land in a row. Kind of a beating. So he knows about this. Okay, let's go ahead and
I mean, might as well just get rid of the cat. Okay. Good game. Good game. That was a good game. And the game two. I don't know why the uh, recording cut off there. Um. Well, we're gonna mulligan this. We will keep this, and we will. What are we gonna put back? Hmm. I think we have to put back this. Mono red, my nemesis. Drug, drug. Okay, light up the stage probably. They always have light up the stage on turn two. Oh, Steamkin, okay. Card, I'm just trying to. Hmm. Yeah, we have to. I can still block. Even if he activates. Nice. Okay. Oh, Robert. <laughs> and he hits, he hits one of my two offs. That's great. Isn't that just great? All right, so let's into this. Okay, hey man, <laughs> I love when people do that. They go to accidentally resolve something and they click on, they click on that. I could potentially keep him off of actually getting a card from Robber of the Rich. Which I don't mind if that actually happens. Walk there, let's him stomp. Let's see what he does. We're gonna. Maybe I should have let him stomp there. I hate this card. Okay. I would love to hit a... What do we bounce here? What do we bounce? Hmm. Think about this guy. Yeah, 
it. So he'll he'll get rid of the Dodger. I'll block, he'll pump, that'll leave to Ferry. Assuming he doesn't have another Haster though. So we need to draw Wrath off the top. This guy's just got everything. Yep. Get a land. Yep. Use it. Okay. Okay, what do we get? What do we get? Hmm. Is this... This does not get us. This gets us an island. with this like it's the phoenix okay thank you for not playing a card first so we should actually be able to cast nickel bolus next turn <laughs> what are you doing? I am one again. We kill we kill this. I think we have to do that. God, I don't want to do that. Okay. Good hit. <laughs> it's going to be funny every time somebody does that. Oh. And he just quit because he misclicked. All right. Good deal. Good deal. Good deal. Good deal. Ranking up. Just keep it going. Adam. All right, so we'll go get an island, play Omen. I wonder what he's playing. Oh, I like when they show us, giggity. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> 
Oh, and obviously you guys can tell that I, I did purchase the uh, the basic lands because they are sick. Easily worth the 15,000 gold that I spent. Easily worth it. Um, I'll play this. You can have any one of these guards. Um... I'm gonna keep both. We don't want to put the Teferi on top because we don't want him to hit the Teferi with the Thought Erasure. Okay. Top or bottom? Top or bottom? Well, no, I am not making this up as I go. Hmm, where'd my camera go? Oh, there it is. All right, so. I don't know if that's right. That worked out. Maybe he plays Teferi and then bounces my Elspeth's Conquerors. Maybe he has his own Elspeth. Okay. I wonder why he made it like this. All 
All right, so <clears throat> Elspeth costs, or Teferi costs five. Don't need any more land. Two. My schemes are never ending. I'm going to keep that interplanar beacon in the hand. Okay. I wonder if he has any any instance that he can play. I'll never expect the doom foretold. Threat down. That's huge. Um, sure. Surprise, Dance of the Mance didn't go there. It's essentially the same card, but better than the Elspeth Con Conquers Death. Okay. You've done it. Congratulations. All right. I should have sacked. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Do it. Yep, good game. Good game. Just doing that ranking. So what are you guys thinking about this deck? This... This deck does just, I mean, obviously it did have good, good luck those first three matches, um, being able to go first. Um, this will be a more, be more of a tell going second here. Watery Grave into Plains. To, I hate this deck.
100 graves into planes and I hate this deck. Yep, attack, light at the stage. Okay. Red black, huh? <clears throat> On the plus sign, we'll, we'll have a blocker next turn. Oof. Oof. Ooh. Blockers. That was a good draw. Good draw. I mean, we're definitely going to uh, block and then wrath. Okay. So, like, where we're we at? If we hit a land, we're really good here with this Phoenix. We can exile. Okay, so we take three. Done. Come on, give me, give us that land. Nice, nice, nice ooh. All right, then let's just see what we get. Okay, Good hit also. That'll actually get us back. This. So we could bounce this. Force him to. Yeah, I think this is better. If he draws a land, he can stomp this and then play the giant. And he's not going to. Okay. Okay. That's fine. We just get it back. Hmm. Okay, I'll take this long. One plus one. Play this. Really good draw. Okay. I don't really see him coming in. Okay. I will be blocking. before I play this element of the sea. I guess it doesn't matter since I draw a card. It replaces itself. Hundred percent blocking. Okay. You mean to play your Ember Cleave? Oh, good game. Good game. We're just ranking up with this deck. Interesting. All 
right, so... Really would love to draw. Okay, so I feel like... Yeah. This is a deck that I saw another streamer playing. So I feel like I have to do this. I don't have to, but I'm going to, even though he gets a draw card. Draw your card, dude. Draw your card. Yep, season of growth. One. On top, huh? I need to draw an island. Double scry here for you. Oh, okay. Paradise Druid. Still double scry. I wish these cost three so I could start uh, conquering death. Oh, there we go. There we go. Bottom, top. Okay. Oh, that's an enchantment. Ah. Oh. Forget a lot about these interactions. Oh, that one? Okay. Jeez. Jeez, so many cards. Of this shenanigans right now. So I think this deck plays the three drop that says when one of your creatures dies, you get a creature back. Okay. Cool. Okay. It seems like a tough match, actually. I don't agree with putting that there at all. I feel like you should put it on the Paradise Druid. Uh, oh, it's got Trample. I'm dumb. Dum dum. Don't worry, guys. Let's hit a wrath. You're not a wrath, and you're not a wrath. And one. 
Probably a million. Well, all the spells do cost a lot. Okay, so that's 24. Not dead yet. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Hit it. Okay. 25. Okay. <clears throat> and then three. on game give me that wrath oh you're not Any sexes bounty and we lose the game. I guess maybe we should have Womp 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 Well, four and one guys. It was a uh, it was a good run. Four and one. No complaints again. The deck performs really well in a lot of uh, different areas. Again, it can you can just kind of grab control early on. Um, you can just take the lead. Really hard to recover from. So uh, again, I recommend giving this deck uh, a shot. Let me move these lands over here so you can get the full count. Uh, again, we don't play this in uh, best of three. I don't have a sideboard for it. Uh, again, I uh, might recommend adding one more dance and then minus one omen um, or minus one omen plus one gargoyle. So tell me guys what you think in the comments down below. Uh, until next time, uh, let me know what you guys want to see in a, in a deck and I will give it a shot. Make a video. Uh, hit that like and subscribe button helps the channel out immensely. And also check out the Hunter Burton Memorial Open.com website for uh, information in regards to our Hunter Burton Memorial Open tourney that's coming up at the end of March. So, again, thank you guys so much. Love you guys. Have a great day.